Hi there. My name is Andrew Camo, and I'm going to be your instructor for this course in managing your data with Microsoft Access. I've been working with Microsoft Access since 1997. I started out probably very much like you're starting out right now. I had some work that I wanted to automate. I wanted to reduce some of the tedious repetition and I decided to use Access to create a database application to hold some of the data and maybe add some functions that I could use to make things easier. After that, I discovered a few more uses for it and other people saw what I could do and so I started designing databases for them. It just kind of snowballed from there. I've been able to work with it for over 20 years now and that's really something when it comes to working with software because software tends to come and go. For one title like Access to be around for over 20 years, it really has to have some pretty wide support from a lot of people and Access does. A lot of people have found ways in which they can make their work and even their lives easier by designing the right applications to manage their data. In addition to my work with Access, I'm also the author of books and articles on Access and other types of database software. I wrote one called Microsoft Access for Beginners several years ago that evolved from a series of articles on my website. I've also written about MySQL, the free and open source database software. In addition to my writing and my database programming, I also have classroom teaching experience at the college level in database programming. So I do have some experience in relaying information to many different people who have various levels of understanding when it comes to computer technology and database software. So I'd like to thank you for taking the time to preview this course. And I want to say a few things about how this course is going to be laid out and what I'm trying to accomplish here. One thing I hear a lot about Access is that it's complicated. It's too complicated for people. It's too difficult for the average person to work with. Well, I will admit that Microsoft Access is complicated because it has a lot of tools that you can use to create your database applications. Microsoft Access offers a lot of things that you don't normally find in one package from the table designers to the report designers and, and data entry forms and a full programming language that you can use to create pretty much any type of application that you want and all of that is in one package. So yes, Access is complex but it doesn't have to be difficult. The great thing about Access is that you can start with a few basic things and learn as you go. You can learn how to design a couple of tables, put together a couple of data entry forms and maybe a report or two, and you can have a working database application that will help you to manage your data and reduce your workload. You don't have to learn everything all at once to become productive with Microsoft Access. That's the approach that I'm going to take in this course. I'll show you the basics of designing your tables. I'll show you how to create a data entry form or two in order to enter your data. And I'll show you how to create a report, a few things about queries. And then you will be at the point where you can create an application. You'll get the sense of how database applications are constructed. And then we'll move on to some of the more complex stuff. But after the initial part of the course, you will be able to be productive with Microsoft Access. I will be adding more content to this course in the upcoming weeks and months and you'll be able to progress further if you keep up with that additional content. Also, if you have questions, please don't hesitate to post them in the Q&A section. I really want to hear back from you. I want to hear what questions you have. I want to hear your feedback about how this course has helped you or or things that you would like to see, or even specific situations that you're running into when using Access that you need help with. I'd really like to hear from you. And above all, enjoy the course. I hope that this course is as enjoyable as it is useful. 
I hope you have some fun working with Access. I know I have. It's It's been a very enjoyable experience all these years. I've gotten a lot out of it, and it has been a springboard to other software and more opportunities in my career. So I hope that you'll find the same. Thanks for watching. Again, if you're still deciding on the course, I hope you'll take some time to look at the other sample videos, and I hope to hear from you in the Q&A section. Thanks for watching.